How's it going? This is Craig Bush Rocks. Welcome to my channel. I went to Rookies today. Oh boy, watch this video. And after the video, we'll see what I got. Oh boy, fun times, man. <laughs> this is Craig Bush Rocks. I'm over at Rookie. It's been a while since I've been here, man. Holy smokes, let's get this video turned around. We, we, it's been what about what? See, you know, it's There's been about what? Been, about three, four weeks it's since been I've been over here. So, yeah. yeah, I've been so busy. This is the calm before the storm. Yeah, this we is the video before free comic, free comic book, book day. day tomorrow, May fourth. <laughs> I figured I better get Star my, Wars Day also. I'm gonna get my primary video out today before tomorrow because there'll be another video probably tomorrow if I'm well, out there here. You go. Yeah, it's the craziness. <laughs> yeah, well, I'll give you. I'll give you a sneak peek. Here's one of the books you pick up at your. Oh, at, your, yeah. at your local comic shop for free. Enter John Universe. Yeah, that is Transformers pretty sweet. G.I. Joe. That's what that is. Pretty sweet. Pretty I can't sweet. wait for free comic book day. Yeah, it's gonna free comic this year. It's going to be an awesome There's day. The Blood Hunt X-Men one from Marvel. Yeah, uh, that's the one I'm... power from DC. The Blood Hunt one I'm definitely getting. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's good, good stuff. <laughs> but so, what's been new so, uh, lately? Oh, man. So, you know, it's been a while. It's been a while. There's new games. New games. I seen you. I seen you. Sonic the Hedgehogs. Here. Have you watched Fallout? <laughs> huh? Have you watched Fallout? Yes, I did. I haven't watched it yet. You I haven't? It's awesome. Yeah, have you played the games? I played a little bit. Not, not very much. Just restocked on the board game. Oh, uh, you know that's been a probably a hot seller. That's that's uh, yeah. Everything Fallout right now is big. I see you got another one down there. So yeah, what games have you? Span. Oh, I heard Anybody about that one. Span? Yeah. Kind of a sequel to, to Wingspan, which is yeah. really popular. Only instead of birds, you got dragons. Ooh. That's pretty sweet. Dragons. I've played it a half dozen times. It's a good game. Good game. What else has come out? Star Realm just be a little little deck you could buy. Now they're, they're putting it in a, like a an all-in-one box. That's a fun little card game. Uh, Wandering Towers, that's a new one. Nice. Yeah, Wandering Towers. Pretty Get your board games, people. Uh, oh. uh, let's see. Cascadia, a sequel to an, ex an expansion for Cascadia. It's Landmarks, an expansion for that game. It's a pretty popular game. And this come back in yesterday, Heat, Pedal to the Metal. It's a racing board game. Very popular. Racing board Great game. Great game. Really <laughs> popular. I'm always out of stock on it. And then there's an expansion coming in today for it. So that's, yeah, so that's some new stuff. I'm not sure what else is new. I know uh, the... We got... Uh, I, I think the last Ronin, the new one, was out. Okay. That's so, the sequel. To, how many issues of... Uh, one. There's only one. Only one? So yeah, it's like bi-monthly. I so, think I got that one already. Yeah, I think, I think you got that one. I haven't read it yet, but I... <laughs> well, let's look at what else there is. A couple new ones this week. Uh, actually, this came out last week. A James Tinian series. He, he writes something about something's killing the children. He's okay. a writer. So that's a new one for for this new company, Distillery. I okay, I was going to wonder who makes it. But yeah, yeah, it's okay. a new company, Distillery. This is also a distillery book. Brian Azzarello. Okay, who's the writer of that one? Uh, he's done a lot of DC stuff, like Batman stuff. Okay. He's kind of a, like, that's a good, like, crime noir kind of stuff. Um, There's my buddy see. Rob. <laughs> Got some new stuff. You haven't seen the new Geiger, Geigerverse. Jeff John's new kind of universe for Image. He's got three books. Okay. They already had a Geiger series. There's a new Geiger and then some, some side series. Uh, oh, dude! New this week, Space Ghost. Do you no. remember Space Ghost? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I remember Space Ghost. I remember that show that that Space Ghost from yeah. coast to coast. There's two generations. <laughs> you either you either remember Space Ghost from the original Hanna Barbera. I remember from that, like the late '70s, yep, early '80s, something like yeah, that. Space Ghost of the Hercules. Or if you're younger, you remember the talk show on Cartoon Network. I remember that too. You remember that? He yeah. was like the, he was the host, and then yep. I forget the villain. But he was like the, the band all, leader. It was, all the, it was like, uh, yeah, Brat, uh, yeah, the little insect guy. Was the, oh, yeah, the insect was the guy. Band leader he was like the, the band leader. Then you had the other volcano who was basically, he was like uh, the technical guy. <laughs> yeah. And then they'd have real guests. 
It was crazy. I remember being at a friend's house because we didn't have cable. Oh, did you ever see yeah, the pilot no. episode for it? Uh, I'm not sure if I did or not. Oh, uh, they had uh, Harvey Birdman. Oh, okay. He was uh, the original host and stuff like that. Only he kept bombing and stuff like that. And then, like one of the producers got out and he's like, uh, "See if Tad Ghostel's available." Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's funny. So yeah, that's a new one this week. Um, there's, yeah. there's some new. There's some other new ones. Salmon Twitch is a new spawn universe series. I know Midlife is done now. Out. Midlife is done. I know. I was getting into that too. <laughs> but we got Bear Pirate Viking Queen. Ooh. So. <laughs> I see a Whisper Queen's a new one, it looks like. Whisper Queen, that's a new one. Um, by, uh, we just call him Chip Z. Chip Z. Yeah, he's a, he's a hot writer. Zadarsky. He, he did the Daredevil run uh, for a while. And then he's got a one shot, too, also by Chip. The White Tree. The White Tree is a one shot. Awesome. And then the big one for Marvel come out this week Blood, Blood Hunt. Hunt. They give you guys a hint about Blood Hunt. Look at this list here. Yeah. <laughs> Over the next three months, Marvel is all about Blood Hunt. Yep. I got a chrome cover. Some different covers. Different cover there. And then they're doing what they call the Red Line version. Mm -hmm. So the main series, they'll have a polybagged explicit content. Sweet. Ultra violent. Ultra Ooh. violent. Is that the one you got me? Great, yep. great for the kids. That goes over there. The one you got pulled out for yeah, that's a, I figure that's the one Rob would want. Heck yeah. Most people, that's that's kind of... Oh, and then there's a new one. Uh, new Sergeant Fury series, too. Get Fury. Which brings back their Max logo, which is okay. adult, adult. Adult. Yeah. Probably ultra-violent also. Yeah, they gotta, for those that like that. They got to push Howard the Duck because they're going to put him in some movies. <laughs> Eventually, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, they've already done those little cameos here and there on like Guardians and then, I think like the, one of the multiverse ones already. So yeah, that's kind of the highlights of new stuff. Oh, the new, you know, you don't want my best selling comics have been the last couple months. Lilo and Stitch. Well, yeah, kids I sold love a ton their, of these. Kids love their Lilo and Stitch. Why is why is Stitch so popular? More popular now than he was when the movie came out. I don't know. <laughs> I think he's a cool character. I like Stitch. It's a cartoon. No, Not anti-Stitch. Anti I'm just saying. I think that they made a, like a cartoon series following that. And so, oh, did they? Yeah. Okay. Oh, and then the latest magic, which has done very well. It's Western theme. Well, it's like seems like Outlaws every Outlaws of Thunder Junction. Seems like every week they come up with a, a new magic. I've, yeah, <laughs> they do a lot. I've restocked a couple times, and I'm still bare bones going into free comic book day. That's not great, but oh well. I'll buy other things. Yeah, <laughs> you know, freak out. Can I get the new magic card? Yeah, set? I know. I, this week I've been selling more and more of it. It's like, we need to set aside a, a box just out. for free comic book. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Multiple boxes. Yeah. Oh, here's new Hero Clicks. Peacemaker. Yeah, another Peacemaker <laughs> one. Project uh, Butterfly. Yeah, I got a Peacemaker one too. Uh, an older one. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they already did one. Is that a Mothra? You're, no, there's no such thing as a Mothra. Okay, it's a monster. Do we show the inside? Yeah. Or is this for the post? They'll, so, they'll see it in the post, too. But, yeah, that's pretty sweet. That's pretty cool. They're doing it season two. But, yeah, we better close this out so I can do All some right. shopping. Yeah, do some shopping and come back tomorrow. <laughs> Free comic book day, May 4th. Yeah, tomorrow. That's right. Turn around, so. Right, turn around a little bit. Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon. I'm already over right. a thousand, so Ding. I'm doing oh, good. Oh, yeah, we're, yeah, now it's just. Yeah, I'm doing Now we're making that. chatter big time. Yeah, good. I'm going to be getting a cut pretty soon. Yeah, yeah, pretty soon. But yeah, big old thumbs up, man. Uh, <laughs> stay tuned for what for my pickups, all right? All, all right. right. Bye. See ya. Oh, wait. Tell people oh, where what? you're located at. Uh, Downtown Lowell, Michigan. Yeah, so free comic book day. Make sure you come down here. Heck yeah, we'll have artists. I have tents up. Opens up at 10. 10 to 5. <laughs> See ya. Yeah. So, what you think of that, man? That was pretty cool. Yeah, hanging out with Jack. It's been about a month since I've seen him, but I'm doing that Blood Hunt series. So, remember, tomorrow, Saturday, May the 4th, free comic book day. So, don't forget to do that. But So, so what's my pickups? Well, you see in this one right here, we're looking at it. Uh, that hero click peacemaker which is pretty cool i like that and uh, behind me i got one of my other peacemaker ones somewhere back there i ain't gonna dig it out right now but <laughs> that's pretty cool i like these hero click iconics 
if you ever want to get these, go to your local comic book store. Look for Hero Click Iconics. They're pretty neat. I like them. But my other one, um, my my other Peacemaker one has Eagly in it, <laughs> but pretty fun. All right, got that. So, what books did I get? Well, let's go for the free ones that they give out every month. These are uh, the Marvel Free, where you can order your your comic books or tell the comic book store what you're looking for. And I'm surprised. I don't know if this has got the, um, I have to look through it. If it's got this new series I'm going to get into, which, is, well, yeah. Yeah, I can't wait. But, yeah, check it out. Marvel one, and here's the DC one. Looks like they got a storyline coming up on DC, too. Absolute power here. Pretty cool. I'll go through this here, and I'll tell Jack Zilla, you know, what books I want, and you know, put them off to the side and stuff like that. That's pretty cool. But what books did I get? I'll go with the first major one, which I, I cannot wait. I'm going to tell Jack, you know, Jack Zilla to go get me a poster to keep track of all these. But the Blood Hunt. I got the, I guess you can call it the Red Band comic. Yes, I cannot wait. I'm doing the whole series. So he's got me down for all the tie-ins and everything. So we'll be talking about a lot of this on the on this channel, Blood Hunt. Normally I wait till I get all the books in a series and I read through it. This one I'm gonna probably get four or five issues, read through them and maybe talk about them. But definitely this one I am gonna read right right away. This one I'm gonna probably read tonight. So this one I am gonna read right away. So yes. First issue. So if you want to get in a blood hunt and don't want to get into all the side stuff, you can get the five issues, which is pretty much this is the first one. And there'll be four more. You could just want to go with the basic storyline. So you can do that. So keep that in mind if you want to do the just the regular blood hunt series and that's it. But if you want to do them all, yeah. You're looking at a lot of a lot of money. <laughs> but Jack gave me and my buddy Rob a free book right here. Barbaric number one. I'm going to read this right after I'm done doing this video here because I want to read this one real quick here just to get, see what it's like. I'm going to, if I like it, I'm going to tell Jack to put me down on the poll list for this one. But pretty cool. This one I got to tell Jack to put me on the list, poll list. But right now I got the second issue. I got, I already read through the first one and um, it's Jack, uh, Jackpot and Black Cat. So I read through the first issue. I like it. So I read through this one. If I like it so far, then I'm going to have him put me down on the pull list for that one. All right. We got the Batman and Scooby-Doo Mysteries. Pretty sweet. I'm digging this series right now. <laughs> I like I like Scooby-Doo and I like Batman. Yeah, it's a kid's comic, but it's still fun to read. You can feel like a kid sometimes when you read through comics. But... All right, uh, make sure I don't mix them all. Let's see. I got a Dark Souls number three, which I still got to read through the series right here. I got one and two, so maybe um, I'll throw one and two in my bag for the night's reading comics. Um, you know, Dark Souls is based, it's based on the video game, but pretty sweet. This one I got to get caught up on reading. I'm behind on this one, but... Uh, I'll get on. I'll eventually get caught up with it, stuff like that. But Doctor Strange, this is issue number fourteen. I think I read seven up to about eight, number eight. So I got a little ways to get caught up. But I like it. It's a complicated read. So if you ever read through this, just keep that in mind. You know, make sure you're like an educated reader because it's a good, it's a good series. But definitely up there in the High epilogue or whatever you want to call it, reading material, but pretty cool. Uh, here's one series. Make sure I don't. Okay, Avatar: Frontiers of Pandora. Now I'm not reading through this yet. I'm gonna wait till I get all six issues of this one. Um, I got the first issue up on my um, counter there. So this is two of six, and this is three of six. Usually when I get short series like this, I'll wait till I get them all before I read through them. So that's cool. 
All right, the next one, this is what I'm reading right now at work. Um, it's Army of Darkness Forever. So this is number seven. So I got the first three issues in my backpack. I think I already read through issue number one. I'll reread it again anyways. I usually, sometimes I read the comic books twice at work. But pretty cool. I'm glad to have this one. Uh, I love Army of Darkness. This was fun. I seen this one in my bat in my in my box there, and I'm glad to have this one in them. I thought they were done with the series and stuff like that. I'm thinking, oh man, it's like okay. Well, I hate Fairyland. I like that one. That's pretty cool. This is issue number thirteen. Well, I figured they were going to be done with this by now, but no, I hate Fairyland. But this is issue number thirteen. I like the cover of this one. It's pretty sweet. <laughs> got the uh, stu S for stupid. So I'm definitely going to read through this. I'm already caught up on this series here. So, yeah. I can't wait to read this one, though. This is cool right here. I've not... Well, maybe I did read the first issue of this one right here. But Ultimate Black Panther. This is the third issue right here. These Ultimate ones right here are pretty sweet. I like these off series. If you have a chance to get into them, check them out. But this is the, the Black Panther one. And here's Miles Morales, uh, Spider-Man number 19. I got to see if I got 18. I think I do, but I'll double check. But I'm almost caught up on this one anyways. When I was doing the, the Gang Wars, I read through all my Miles Morales books. So I'm pretty much caught up on that one. Really good series to get into. I cannot wait to talk about this some more when I read some more of it. And that's the Superior Spider-Man. This is number six. This is the last book I picked up. I got some stuff at Rookies I might pick up tomorrow, maybe. I'm going to trade in some tokens. So it'll be another, it'll be another comic video tomorrow because a free comic book day is tomorrow. So it's, it's, a, it's a comic book video weekend because it is. It's one of my favorite days. It's uh, May the 4th, the first Saturday of every – the first Saturday of May – Every year is free comic book day. So it's just like May the 4th. Every time I think of that, May the 4th be with you. You know, Star Wars and stuff like that. But pretty sweet. I cannot wait for tomorrow. So stay tuned. There will be a video out tomorrow with a uh, free comic book day. So that's going to be awesome. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give me a... No, no thumbs down for this video. You can't do that. <laughs> comment down below what you think of the you know comment down below what you think of the video got my buddy rob in it this time you know talking about comics that was great hanging out with jack zilla but yeah make sure you comment make sure you subscribe try to do videos every day make like i said occasionally i'll take a day off where i need a break yeah working every day pretty much <laughs> <laughs> but yeah i'll check y'all in the next video fun times everybody have a good one